So Nikocado Avocado shocked the entire internet with his latest upload. And just when I started thinking YouTube was dead, BAM! This guy uploaded a video and he's currently number two on trending, which is fucking fantastic. And of course, let's find out what happens next. Two steps ahead. I Why are you wearing a panda mask? Two steps ahead. This has been the of who, me? greatest social experiment of my entire life. No way! It's alluring. It's compelling. It's gripping to observe all these unwell, disoriented beings no fucking the internet in search of stories. Bro! Ideas, rivalries, where they feel encouraged and engaged, where they involve themselves with the stories and become a product. He's calling everyone an idiot, what? Thirsty for a distraction from time unspent, Spoiling their minds, yet stimulating them at the same time. Broski! It's and it's dangerous. No! I feel as if I'm monitoring ants on an ant farm. One follows another. Yo. Follows another. What the fuck? Another. It's mesmerizing. It's spellbinding. All these little consumers. All of these lost and bored. Ah! People. People consuming anything that they're told to consume. So I am. Bro, what the fuck? Because I've made myself one. What the fuck? And you. Why do you look like that? Continue to consume these stories about me year after year. No. After year. No. For as long as I tell the internet that I am the villain. What? No way, y'all! He called himself the villain! So he's trying to say that everyone is a pawn? An ant in an ant farm? He's the villain brainwashing people? And now what? Look at, look at him! Bro, look! I remember when he used to be... like that! And now he just lost that weight so suddenly... Bro. He fooled the entire internet. That is fucking crazy. Stories that permeate and linger. And yo, why does it seem like he got like of the ants. more intelligent? Influence the ants. Brainwash the ants. You. Oh shit, me no. Ants. Today I woke up from a very long dream. And I also woke up. No way. Having lost 250 pounds off of 250 body. pounds? Yesterday, people were calling me fat and sick. Ah. And boring. But like, yo, what would you expect them to call you? Like, if you're if you're 200 pounds overweight, calling you healthy or normal would hurt you more. Then someone who calls you a fat fuck, a lazy fuck, a dumb fuck, that should motivate you to lose weight. I was fat at one point too, but look at the look at me now, bro. Look at me flex. That's all the negativity. I converted that negativity into positivity. And Nikocado, man, you did great with the weight loss, but yo, don't feel entitled to any positive comments. I mean, sure. People are assholes on the internet, but I'm sure, yo, you should, you know, change it. People. People are the most messed up creatures on the entire planet. Okay, you got that right, man. You got that right. And yet I've still managed to stay two steps ahead. But how are you two steps ahead? You keep saying Not that. Everyone. The joke's on you. On my shoulder? Actually, let me put you back. This is so and look, bad. he's still back to the mukbang. I know what I know what's gonna happen next. My prediction is that uh he's gonna go back to his original weight, go back to being skinny, and he's just gonna have a cycle, a vicious cycle, going round and round and round like a Ferris wheel.
This guy, yo, this guy, he, look, I mean, look at the food, bro. He's obviously he's going to go back to his old ways. Noodle, you're missing out. See. Okay. I'm back. And we're just getting started, which is what's really exciting. Yeah, he is going back to it being feels fat. Good to be back. It feels good to be hanging out with you guys. I'm also going to add a little more sesame seed. Okay, he's gone off the it. rockers. <laughs> Bye. Oh, I'll see you on my other channel. I'm going to link it. That tells There's you he's going to make more videos like this. There's another video out. Don't miss it. I'm going to link it down below. I'll see you on over there. Bye. Okay, so I mean, the whole reason Nick Akato is even popular is the mukbang videos. That's what keeps him rich. That's what keeps his pockets flooding, bro. But he can't be doing this too much because he's going to ruin his health. But at the same time, he needs money. So I don't know. If I was Nick Akato, I would, I don't know, probably be a little scared because I don't know if, uh, I don't know if, what I'm doing, should I do what I am still doing and should I do, should I get, should I fucking make money or should I just be poor and broke? Obviously this is very hard on him cause he, A, he doesn't want to be very fat cause he's, he's going to get a lot of health problems, but B, he's going to miss out on the viewerships, the money and everything. So I don't know, man, if I. It's a difficult place to be. I would say, yo, Nick, if I had to give you some advice, I would say try to strength train a little bit so at least you could put on some muscle while you're gaining that fat. So at least, at least your body metabolic rate is higher so you could lose more fat. Other than that, man, I would say while you're fat, just have like a bunch of videos just pre-recorded upload them you know keep them like make like 200 videos right because you're gonna stay fat for you, you for 200 days just keep making those mukbang videos and then just go back to your you know your desired weight and then just slowly upload them one two three even if you upload one one video every month you have like at least at least more than five years so i think that's the best of both worlds because you get to live the life you want and uh you're still making money so you know that's my idea for you nick if you're watching this man you know comment down below i'm not i'm not saying anything negative about you but some things you do need to change some things we all need to change we're not perfect we're all fucking humans but if you enjoyed it man you don't have to like the video but you can and i'm signing out